Real-Time Export Guide In this step, you are going to configure the export format. Run Xportal 2005 Client. There are two default system user for the system. Please enter user ID and password. To configure export format, go to Reports, Event Report and Transaction Reporting. View Transaction window will be shown. Click on Export to button. Transaction Export setting window will be shown. You can add a new export format by clicking on the Add button. Enter the profile code and profile name. Choose the file type based on your preference. You can set the header, row delimiter, column delimiter, and text qualifier. Select the field that you prefer to include in the export. Here is an example of fields that will be included in the export. You can see the format and sample of the report at the output section. Click OK to save the settings. You have successfully added a new export format. In this step, you are going to configure the real-time export settings. Run Xportal 2005 server at system tray. Right-click on Xportal 2005 icon and click server. There are two default system user for the system. Please enter user ID and password. You have successfully logged into the server. To configure real time export, go to Transaction, Export Transaction. There are three steps that you need to configure. The first step is to set the destination folder and file creation. Browse the destination folder that you want to store the transaction. Choose the file creation by day or by hour. The second step is to configure the file name settings based on your preference.
you can define the timestamp format. Click OK to continue. Choose the file name extension to save as TXT or CSV format. The third step is to set the export format and transaction type. Choose your preferable export format that you want. Choose the transaction type to export attendance only or all transaction. Do not forget to click activate to activate the real time export. Click save and close to continue. You have successfully configure real time export settings. In this step, you are going to view the exported transaction. Go to the destination folder that you have set. Open the transaction report using Notepad or Excel. This is an example of the exported transaction. You will see the transaction type based on your selection. You have completed real-time export guide. We would love to hear your feedback about this video. Let us know. At microengine.net slash support. You also may find us on Facebook, YouTube and Google+. Thanks for watching.